The commission that controls how much water is let out of Lake Ontario forecasted this week that the lake will not hit the flood levels like in previous years. Communities along both the Canadian and American shores are wary, however, given all the flooding that happened back in 2017 and 2019. Rob Hackford was up in Niagara County today and has more for us. Kate, the water level here in Newfane and Olcott is already above average, which means there is some worry amongst neighbors. But even if we get more rain than expected, the International Joint Commission, which put out that report this week, predicts that the southern shore will be safe this summer and through the season. There has been a lot of work done here over the past few years to make sure that remains the case. $16 million from the state's Ready Fund, a resiliency program meant to beef up the Lake Ontario shoreline, was spent here to protect against above average lake levels like we're seeing now. The water rises in the spring, especially because of snow melt, but not everyone is protected. Ed Pettit had some new stone and a bunch of sandbags put in recently. After he started seeing his back frontage wash away, the lake is 11 inches higher right now compared to the April average, and no one wants to see it come anywhere near the record, which is 19 inches beyond that. So they're hoping this forecast is accurate. Two weeks ago, when we saw how close it came to the house, that really concerned us. I was actually more concerned than I was two years ago. Um, and we feel a lot better now, uh, recently with, with all this that has been done. We're expecting that, that water levels will continue to rise for a few more weeks and then taper off and crest um, uh, well below any um, uh, kind of flooding levels that we've had reported in the past. Um, so we, we probably will see, you know, a few more inches up to maybe six to eight inches more at most um, I would expect over the next few weeks. I, I can't imagine them having Lake Ontario waters uh, uh, hold anymore. Uh, I mean, if, if this is the new normal, uh, thank heavens, New York State has come out with ready funds and, and we hope this is it. Now, the International Joint Commission just finished the first phase of reviewing their guidelines for letting out water from Lake Ontario. That review is available to the public, and you can also comment on it. I'll also have more on it coming up at 5 o'clock. In Newfane, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.